Whether you're shivering in the winter chill or sweltering in the heat and humidity, there's only one thing you need to remember. When the temperature hits you, just get a Fujitsu. And right now, when you buy a Fujitsu air conditioner, you'll receive a digital prepaid MasterCard worth up to $450. Buying your upgrading, Fujitsu, Australia's favourite air. Hello again from the National Gallery of Victoria. Here at the NGV International, Friday nights are taking on a vibrant, creative flair inspired by the nightlife of Picasso's Paris. This series is running alongside the incredible Winter Masterpieces exhibition, The Picasso Century. Local musicians will be performing each week. Nairi is headlining tonight, and it really is the perfect Friday night out, not just to enjoy the music and late night access to the exhibition, but the very popular Melbourne restaurant Ballerinia is also offering a dining experience celebrating Spanish food and culture. And it has been perfect indoor weather today. The city peaked at 14 degrees, and we're currently sitting on 11. Showers continue today on and south of the ranges. Totals have mostly been between 2 and 8 millimetres and maximums generally range from 8 to 15 degrees. The cold southwesterly airstream is set to continue into the weekend. Winds will strengthen further tomorrow as a low pressure system moves near Tasmania. An associated cold front will push across Gippsland tomorrow night. So eastern parts of the state will cop the brunt of this system. Blustery conditions will persist on Sunday morning before starting to ease in the afternoon. The public holiday on Monday will be much more settled and mostly dry with any shower activity likely to be confined to coastal locations as well as the Yarra Ranges in the morning. A severe weather warning for damaging winds has been issued for the weekend. Peak gusts of around 90 kilometres an hour are expected to develop tomorrow morning around Wilson's Prom and the Streslecky Ranges and even stronger, up to 110 for East Gippsland's exposed coast, as well as alpine areas. And blizzard conditions are expected across the peaks during the middle part of Sunday. Showers will only be light, though, up to 5 millimetres for the Latrobe Valley and even less elsewhere. Temperature-wise, inland places should get down to 3 or 4 overnight, and maximums will generally range from 9 degrees at Ballarat up to 15 at Mildura. Here in Melbourne, it's minimums of 6, 7 or 8 before most suburbs climb to 12 or 13, 14 degrees for Robud, Rosebud and once again showers will most likely be in the east, up to 5 millimetres at Burning Creek. A millimetre at most in the city and a top of 13, 12 degrees on Sunday and up to 5 millimetres, just a slight chance of a shower for the Queen's birthday match at the G and it almost goes without saying you will need a thick jacket, 12 degrees, 13 on Tuesday, showers return on Wednesday, a top of 14 and then a pair of 15 degree days with showers lingering. NGV Friday nights run each week through to October the 9th, so there's plenty of time to get along and soak up the Picasso Century exhibition and party vibes. And Alicia, I'll have to have a cheeky mulled wine for you just to stay warm, of course. <laughs> I would expect nothing less. Enjoy, Maddie. Thank you very much for that. And that is Nine News this Friday. A Current Affair is up next. I hope you have a wonderful weekend for now. Good night.